you don't want all of your internal processes ranked in public Google search results. I've seen it happen. <laughs> Two things I want you to be very careful of with Google Sites. Number one is to make sure you have two-step verification enabled for your domain. You need to do this in the admin panel and we highly recommend you enforce this as a policy inside Google Workspace. Very, very important to make sure that anyone who has access to your Google Workspace accounts, because they're gonna get access to effectively all of your IP inside a Google Site, that they're locked down correctly. This is probably where I would go. If I was going to try and hack someone's business, I'd probably want to learn about their processes so I could learn how to socially engineer and maybe pretend to be someone within the company. And you've all heard about those scams where business director will get an email from their CFO saying, hey, can you please make a deposit into XYZ supplier account by today? Otherwise, they're not going to release our goods and we need to get them paid. And all of a sudden, you're sending money to somebody else and they're withdrawing that and then it's gone. Those scams are actually pretty common, unfortunately. And the easiest way to get into a Google account is if two-factor authentication is not switched on or enforced. So that's number one. Number two, any Google sites that you are creating, you need to make sure that you check the security settings and the sharing settings on that Google site and make sure that drafts and the published site are both set to restricted. Very, very important because Google sites can be used to create a public website if you want. And so when you create a public website with Google Sites, anyone on the internet can access it and it will be ranked and appear in Google search results. Now you don't want all of your internal processes ranked in public Google search results. I've seen it happen <laughs> when someone didn't set this setting correctly. So be very, very careful. Do you want to make sure that you get these two things right? And of course, if you have our team help you deploy a site, they'll make sure that this is done correctly. If you like this content, please hit subscribe and hit the bell notification so you can be notified when we go live or drop new content on the channel. Now, if you'd like to connect with us, hit us up on social media or join our free community group. All the links to that are right below this video. If you'd like to learn more about Google Workspace and the technology ecosystem, you can join our free Genius Academy by transferring your billing across to IT Genius, or you can join a Workspace Basics Bootcamp. Now, if you're a business owner and you're interested in an audit on your technology stack, or your workspace account, or you're looking to do a project in the tech world, well, you can take advantage of our free consultation. And if you need help right now, then consider joining Concierge or taking up a quick fix with our team for professional support for your tech stack.